We're out on another short boat trip today. We're gonna take happy hours over to Fort Myers, Mantanzas Bay, and check out Doc Ford's restaurant that's on the mainland side. It took a lot of damage after the hurricane, but it's open for business and it allows dogs at the dock. They have seating uh, outside on the first floor down by the water, which is perfect, just what we're looking for. So uh, we're gonna be staying overnight. We're gonna anchor in the, uh, the anchorage by the mooring field and hopefully have nice weather. It's supposed to rain a little later, but uh, we're looking forward to a nice quick run out to Fort Myers Beach, so stick around. We have the Coast Guard pulling over a boat that came racing in here. Although it doesn't get slow speed until that buoy, I believe. Coincidentally, that's the same Coast Guard boat that uh, pulled me over when I had a charter in here one day for a courtesy inspection. All right, we're entering Mantanzas Bay. We have the mooring field straight ahead as you come in the channel. Here for Bowditch Park, Bowditch Park, however you pronounce it. Still banged up from Hurricane Ian. Pink Shell Resort redid their docks. Looking all nice and spiffy. There is still some houses though in poor condition. That's probably going to come down. So Fort Myers opened up the mooring field here on the north side of the bridge. It used to just be on the south side of Van Tans's bridge. So they took up this entire anchorage, which used to be just free anchoring. Now there's mooring balls, so nobody's using them. There are some spots that you could drop anchor at. I see a lot of boats back that yeah. way. Yes, seems like people would prefer free anchorage. Yes, people prefer free, yes they do. The old Mantanzas mooring field, which is being rebuilt. All right, we spun around. Now we're looking back under Mantanzas Bridge. It's the direction we just came under. We're going to cut around here over to the right and check out that restaurant, see if it'll be all right if we can pull up later. strong cross current when you're coming in here. Tide's coming in, sort of pulling us to the right. And up here, all right, Doc Ford's over here on the left. Let's check out their docks. Doc Ford's Rum Bar and Grill. Yep, plenty of docking. Looks like nice new docks. And we could fit in there. Plenty of docks. Okay, here's a first. We're gonna try to snag one of these mooring balls here and pay for our dockage here for the night. However, this is Bridget's first time doing this, so it should be interesting. <laughs> Just get that bow line ready first. You untie it. All right, that took two of us. So we are tied up to mooring ball 16. 
How was it? It was... Uh, honestly, get rid of the mooring balls and let us just anchor. It's 10 times easier. All right, here we are, mooring ball 16. At Mantanza's mooring field. So, Bridge, what do you think of using a mooring ball? I think that it was our first time and we didn't understand this one, and I think next time it'll be a lot easier. Yeah, so the, uh, the eye that you put your rope through, your dock line, um, that was like stored on top of it, which I didn't expect. So, uh, and it's filled with barnacle. So, um, it was a little heavy to pull up, and of course it sinks as soon as you let it go. So, it took a few tries. So this is a nice place to watch the boats go by. And it only cost us $26 for the night. It's not too bad. Although, I really do prefer just dropping anchor. But the entire bay here is taken up by mooring balls. Thank you, Fort Myers. Instead of just leaving it open for anchoring. But uh, I guess that keeps all of the derelict vessels out. So it does serve a purpose in that regard. All right, we were just getting ready to head over to the restaurant. But then this storm's rolling in. We might want to wait this one out. We have plenty of food on the boat. We had a great time sitting here at the mooring, watching all the boats go by. This is one reason why we like to keep the plastic up. We can close it up quick, chill out up here while it's raining. I think it's raining. Yep. It's yep, it's raining. Good rinse for the boat. Yep. The jet skier is getting soaked. They're not obeying their own weight zone. I wouldn't either. Nobody's getting pulled over in this. All right, I think the rain finally stopped. Had a lot of boats running home, but that's it. We're eating well on happy hours tonight. We're not gonna make it to the restaurant. It's okay. Yeah, people are still partying here. The rain is gone. It stopped raining. The sun is starting to come out again. We're barbecuing. Look at this. Here we are, chilling at Fort Myers Beach. So we had a relaxing evening at the mooring. No one is still up there. And we have the Key West Express coming out for its journey. Fort Myers to Key West. We didn't get to Dock Ford yesterday, but we're going to try it today for lunch. Yep. Before we head home for the day. We got nice. rained out. Yeah. They saw all that. It seems like the mad rush to get over to the restaurant now for lunch. Well, we missed it by uh, five minutes. We're not going to be able to get in there. All right, Doc Master said he's going to get us in there somewhere. Let's see. 
All right, they got us in here at the dock right here at Gulf Star Marina, right next to Dock Forts. All right, we made it. The dock hand was very helpful. They filled up over here at this dock, but we could use Gulf Star Marina if they're not busy. They were nice enough to let us use it. Good boy. You can be a good boy. Yes, you can be a good boy. Fun play. Ooh, he's gonna go Great. right in the Great. right in the drink one of these days. Little lunch place, Doc Fours. Yeah, this if you like spot. it, yeah. pretty good, right? Yeah, it will definitely bring people back. Yeah, it's really nice. I think it's one of the nicest outdoor places far as fun setup yeah. and uh, water views. yeah nice water view you can see boat traffic yeah. back and forth right. You're real close um, to food was really good I like the fish the grouper was yeah. good Maybe what was that maybe was so so yeah he was okay oh, yeah, you're his right. tongue hanging was out was... Yeah. Um, what was that Yucatan yeah. shrimp yeah their sauce their special sauce yeah. you could buy it at the store very good that we had that dipping bread in that was really good so we're gonna take a slow ride back to Cape Coral after our quick overnighter here in Fort Myers Beach so Fort Myers Beach definitely picking up starting to get in season as they call it we're now uh, October 1st you know, restaurants starting to open up a lot of boat rentals going out the city is starting to reopen after repairing from Hurricane Ian. Great place to come for the day. Hop around at some of the restaurants. And sitting here at the mooring field was nice, just watching the boats go by. Not bad for 26 bucks. So we'll be back again, Fort Myers Beach. We'll be sure to bring you along. Mm -hmm.